Hello one and all. We hope you all had a wonderful Easter if you celebrate it and weren't caught out by too many April Fool strokes. Now that it's safe to hear it, here's all the biggest news from the past week. While we don't yet know exactly when The Witcher Season 2 is coming out, it's just passed a big milestone, as Netflix confirms that filming has wrapped. In a tweet, Netflix says, That's a wrap on Season 2. The White Wolf awaits you back on the continent. An image of star Henry Cavill holding a clapperboard and looking very pleased about it is attached, which leaves us very pleased too. People Can Fly's loot shooter Outriders has landed with a bang. Propelled by positive buzz from its extensive demo, the game rocketed into Steam's top 10 on launch day. While we did see the same server issues that plague so many online multiplayer games on day one, it looks to be publisher Square Enix's biggest Steam launch ever. Outriders reached a peak concurrent player count of almost 112,000 just a couple of hours after liftoff as SteamDB shows. Despite the full retail price tag, that's more than twice the player count that the free demo brought in. World of Warcraft's next update is coming to the PTR later this month for you to try, according to a forum post by developer Blizzard. The Chains of Domination update includes a new storyline, a new raid, and another mega dungeon for you and your pals to master. A year and a half after Rise of Skywalker brought it to a close on the big screen, the LEGO version of the Skywalker saga still isn't out. The game's latest release date was set for Spring 2021, but the devs have pushed it back again without announcing a new release window. And there you have it. A wee Star Wars delay to contend with, but plenty of WoW and Outriders content to enjoy while you wait it out. Thanks for watching, like and subscribe if you enjoyed and check in next week to keep up to date.